around the holiday of love is coming up, Valentine's Day, and we're going to do a video on our suggestions for your self-defense enthusiast significant other. What? Yeah, I would say. Okay. Yeah. Top 10. <laughs> <laughs> First item suggestion, is your significant other a strong, independent, gun-toting woman? <laughs> Are they in need of a really great concealed carry gun-toting purse or merce? <laughs> we found this really sleek crossbody carry purse. That will provide easy access to her concealed carry weapon. Say, here you go, honey. This way you can be styling while you're piling bodies, that is. But only bad guys. All right, so first on my list was Mace. I think Mace is a great gift. For any occasion, not just the holiday <laughs> of love. <laughs> I'm a very practically minded person, I guess, as I realize as I'm bringing this up. Uh, <laughs> Me too, but I still have a sense of humor. <laughs> what is it? You can get it many different colors. They've got like black and pink and I don't know. Black? <laughs> <laughs> My favorite type is actual mace brand. The lid on the top keeps you from pressing it before you actually need to press it. You have to actually insert your thumb. It's really quick, it's really easy, there's nothing to turn, and it's very usable. This makes burns like my love for you. On the more inexpensive side, we have a self-defense knife. Mace is not expensive. But that wasn't on my list, that was on your list. Okay. This Valentine's Day themed knife comes in lots of different colors and styles to match your significant other's personality. And it cuts. <laughs> Bonus. Valentine's Day is short, so let me just cut to the chase. I love you. All right, so the next thing on my list would be the stun gun. Uh, Saber's got a stun gun. It comes in black, pink, black, purple or black. Um, I really like those. Pick my favorite color of those. It's fine. They work really well. Understanding the sun gun, you've got to get close for them to actually work. But I, I like them. They're also another great inexpensive type of gift. Here's a gift that is as stunning as you are. Now I did do a second concealed carry purse option and this one comes with a matching holster that is detachable from the purse itself. Also crossbody carry. So you can be matching by your packing. Next on my list is a little more expensive. It is the Cold Steel AK-47 self-defense knife. I really, really like this knife. So much so that it's probably gonna be my next purchase if I don't get it for Valentine's Day. Here is a gift that is looking as sharp as you are, dear. Next on the list is a tactical escape bracelet. It is a tungsten bead bracelet that will break glass if you are trapped in a car or um, any of your glass breaking needs. It's also small and not by any means inconvenient to wear. So you can escape anything except our love. Next thing on my list is going to be a Streamlight ProTac tactical flashlight. Uh, this thing is really, really awesome. It's like 500 lumens. Uh, it will blind anyone in the dark very, very well. It comes in one color because that's the only color you need. I'm assuming that color is black. Love is blind, much like anyone who gets hit with this flashlight. Next, if your woman isn't really the stabbing or packing type, we have the Invisiwear Personal Protection Jewelry. You can get this in bracelet form, hair tie form, necklace form, and they look really nice, but they also, if you click a button on the back three times, it will send your location to the police and five emergency contacts. 
This is perfect if your love song is every step you take, every breath you make, I'll be watching you. <laughs> but only if you press the button. Invisiwear. I got nothing. Nip, nip, nip. Last thing on my list is the Atomic Bear Rebel Tactical Pen. I really like this tactical pen because it's super strong, it's great, and it doesn't look like a weapon. It doesn't look like a tactical pen. Most people don't think twice about it once they see it. Writes nice, punches holes nice. You could probably get it in, you probably get it engraved if you want to. Probably. Oh, what's that? It's got your name on it. It's my stabbing pen, honey. <laughs> I hope you're ready for a stew pen this Valentine's Day. Now, I'm not gonna let them have this back. I'm gonna give you my pick for the best Valentine's Day present. It is another Atomic Bear tactile pin, but this one also has a flashlight. It's kind of like two tools in one. Well, technically three, because it's got a glass break, a regular pin, and a flashlight. And I'm sure that I can come up with a few more ideas on how to use, but hey. Thank you guys so much for watching. Look down in the description to find out how you can purchase these items. Bye. All right, guys, so we are here today and we are going to do a video on what kind of self-defense gifts can you get. Now, we need to actually talk about the fact that Valentine's Day is coming up. Hang on. Just hang on. You got it. You know how we're going to end at the start of this? Yeah. So we're just going to put all this at the end of the old bloopers. Like, I'm just getting started before I know what I'm saying. <laughs> Because you want it to be interesting. I do, yes. Today we are going to talk about because about you know. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I had it all worked out in my head. Did I do any of the things that I had worked out in my head? No. I just started talking. <laughs> Go ahead. Okay. <clears throat> she wants to be interesting, so she's going to speak, not let me speak. I see how it is. <laughs> you just don't sound super excited. I'm more excited than I sounded. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Oh gosh. Control of myself now. And because you're able to stick your thumb straight, it keeps, there's no, I don't have it in my hands. 